Hello guys, once again, this is Foxcode here, and I've just been doing a little programming, I'm finishing up now, I've been on for, oh my, yeah, eight hours apparently, and this is my game, it was originally going to be asteroids, but as you can see, there are no asteroids, there are eight spaceships, and I was reading online recently, and I think it was just some random Python code, I don't know exactly what, but I found out you can embed Python in C++, so I had a cool idea. What if I have a game, my C++ game here, with all my spaceships and my nice particle effects and all my lasers, and instead of making a game as such, I actually embed Python to control the AI. So say I make the game, everyone else can code their own AI, and then you put the red team versus the blue team and have some fun. And I just thought that would be a cool idea. And so, as you can see, all of the ships are moving at once because the controls are still set up for asteroids, so they're going off my keyboard input for now rather than any AI because I haven't done the interpreter bit yet. That's the next thing to do after sorting the UI out. I added this nice zoom in, zoom out feature today, which works now. Took a bit of doing. Whoop. Is this the right view level? I still need to add um, some scroll implementation so I can move around a lot easier. I also want to have an option so I can follow a ship automatically, like I just double click on it and it'll follow. Uh, but that's just some simple camera controls to implement. Um, we see we have the green bar for hull strength, blue bar for shield, and in fact look at this, we can zoom right in. EWS, E is for the status of the engines, W is for the weapons, and S is for the sensors. So, if the engines are damaged, the ship moves slower. If the weapons are damaged, ship fires slower. And if the sensors are damaged, that's actually an interesting one. Um, the first idea I had, and what I want to do, is to limit the amount of data the opposing... Yeah, sorry, the a let's start that again. If you are fighting, you have your AI. That AI needs data from the game. Now, if the sensors on that ship are damaged, I want the computer to send kind of half-true data back to the ship. I want to falsify some of it, so maybe it'll get the positions of the enemy ships a bit off. Maybe it'll be wrong about the direction, speed, all that. So, as the sensors get more damaged, the more errors it's going to crop up into the information, and I thought that was really cool. I may also make it limit the range of detecting weapons incoming, so you've also got less data, but I'm not exactly sure on that. Uh, Anyway, I just thought it was quite an interesting concept, guys, and uh, tell me what you think. See you later.